0-1 pitch to Story. That one's hit well to right field. That's chasing Peralta back. He's at the wall. It's gone. That's a three-run home run for Trevor Story. Welcome to big leagues, Trevor. Rockies take a 4-1 lead. Opposite field home run for Trevor Story in his second major league at bat. 11 years that a Rocky rookie has homered in his big league debut. 2 0 pitch is hit pretty well to left field. Tomas just turns to watch it sail halfway back in left. Touch him all time for the second time for Trevor's story. And the Rockies lead it 7 to 1. Well, do you write the script at this point in the ballgame any better than that for Trevor Story? Three at bats and two home runs, a three run shot to right and a solo shot deep to left. What a night, Trevor Story. In the air, high and deep right field. Could it be? You bet! Greg Salami and the Rockies take the lead. He didn't try to do too much. It wasn't a pull swing, was it? It was not. You just trust yourself. Trust your ability to put the barrel on the ball. And Story hits it well to the right. Did he get enough of this? That ball is gone. Back to back home runs. Again, we question when Archie went out there. No one can teach you how to pitch after you've hit a triple and driven in two. Two outs to Story. This ball driven high and deep left center field. Way back. Gone. Grand slam. How hot is Trevor Story? We are uh, here in the mountaintop press box. Here's a shot Ready into the go. corner. Back at the wall, tie game. Trevor Story has tied it. A 2-2 game and Story, the shortstop for the Rockies, shoots it out of here. This ball hit a long way to center field. Did he clip it? Way back. Two. And that ball's crushed deep left field. Take a good look. You won't see it for long. In fact, on a hop, it may have left the ballpark. Two to one, Colorado. You know, people aren't going to believe this when they see this ball where it goes because what happened to Trevor after he hit it? 29th home run for Story. Rockies take the lead. Second time he's victimized Suarez. Watch this on this swing. Watch him fall, Drew, on the Subaru Supermo. His spikes leave. That's 110 miles an hour off the bat as he watches it go onto the concourse from his backside. Are you kidding me? Wow. <laughs> Story into the gap in right center, however. It's the third extra base hit for Colorado tonight. And a runner in scoring position with two away. Story with a bouncer that gets through into left. And the go-ahead run is aboard with one away in the ninth. A couple of hits tonight for Trevor Story. A bouncer that's going to sneak through into left. Trevor Story, the most potent hitter in this lineup. The power that he's shown, especially coming back from his injury. Walters with a base hit up the middle, and the Rockies have taken the lead. Three straight, two out singles. Colorado back on top. The 0-2 pitch he is lined to a diving Trevor Story. Throws, nope, not going to throw back to first as the runner, Elmora, scrambled back. A diving grab by Story, leaping to his right for the second out. Well, he'll do it right now. Home run number 100. About 30 rows up, and the Rockies are within a run. 100 career home runs. The fastest shortstop ever to that mark. By quite a few games, too. Deep drive right field. This 
this will get it done. In fact, Trotter around the bases. Two run, walk off home run, Trevor Story. Working on his next hundred. Eight, six, Colorado. Sure, uh-oh. Stay up, stay deep, get out, gone. Two run, home run, Trevor Story. That went as far <laughs> as it was high, or as high as it was far. Two nothing, Colorado. Add on with one out. Hard oh. down the left field line. That'll score at least two. Walter scores. Marquez scores. Tapia around third. Three run double. Trevor Story. Showing off for Coach Tucker. <laughs> Already five RBIs on the night. This ball hit a long way to center. Davis going back again. He's got no shot. How about a new career high in ribbies? Seven of them tonight for Story. Manny right back up the middle. Story, a diving stop. Flip to second oh. for one and a double play. Trevor Story showing off the glove a couple of times here in the first inning. A DP to end it as the Padres, the victim of some flashy defense up the middle. Well, Trevor Story sitting at 34. Make it 35. I wouldn't Walk be mad. It up. No, I would not be mad, and neither would the St. Louis Cardinals. And this could be his last hit of the night. Get out ball. Yeah. It does. Walk off the run. Trevor Story fires up the fountains at Coors Field, and Colorado has spoiled the Brewers once again. How about it, Trevor Story? Trevor Story won his second consecutive Silver Slugger Award, making him the 10th player in Rockies history to win the award for multiple seasons. Deep short, Trevor. Got him, what a play. As good as it gets, Trevor Story. There goes the runner, they throw through, and another stolen base for Trevor, his 14th, which leads baseball. Now two out there for Blackman. Yeah, this is a good break from Trev. Slight glance over the shoulder, then the head first dive. Right before that tag is put down. John Gray singled in a run, is at third. Tapia singled in a run, he's at second. Hampson just walked. He is at first. High fly, deep left field. Take a good look. You won't see it for long. Gray. Slam, Trevor Story. They wanted something to cheer about. They got, they got something to cheer about. Remember Top when he hit the walk off? How he kind of stood there. Watch what Trevor does as soon as he hits his slider. He knows it immediately. He looks over to the dugout. He's yelling at his boys. Let's go. And that came within a couple rows going on the concourse. That was a grand flight. Just the way he connected with that ball out front. <laughs> Let's go. I love it. This ball hammered deep center field. Way back, got a chance. Ball game over. Trevor Story time. Story has won it on a walk-off blast. Third career walk-off home run for Trevor. His first home run in 70 at-bats. I'd say it took long enough, but it came at the right time. Drills it to right center. Story time. On a Sunday, first sweep, three-game sweep for the Rockies in 2021. What a perfect end to the weekend. That 70 at bat stretch without a home run, the longest Trevor had ever gone. Let's go, yo. I'm Trevor Story with the Colorado Rockies. This is Kicking It by Nike. All right, we're gonna start with my home cleats for this year. We designed these with Nike. I felt like it took a long time, but 
you know, very detailed. A lot went into this with me and the design team. Uh, so I'm really proud of these. As you can see, you got a little baby blue in there. Uh, that's kind of my color of choice if I had to pick any. I think it goes pretty good with the purple too. But yeah, let's get into the details. You know, I got the little speckle on the laces there. And I guess my favorite part about this is the little blue bonnets here that we got with the design. That's kind of just a homage, paying homage to my hometown, Irving, Texas. So I thought that was cool. This logo here that helps me, you know, remember the sacrifice, remember, you know, why, why I do what I do. Um, it's also um, a foundation that helps foster care children get shoes. So I think I think that's pretty cool too. We got the 27 right here on the top the strap. We got the little Jeter too right there. Obviously, that's my favorite player. Been my guy ever since I was little. Huge inspiration to me. Yeah, man, that's that's what we got for the homes for 2021. All right, now we got the aways for 2021. These I kind of stepped out on a little bit this year. As you can see, also the, the baby blue accents, the silver bottom right here. That's crazy, man, but it looks really good. Went with the kind of the safari print here on the toe. You know, inspiration from the retro Jordans that you know, I have a big collection of those. I, I really just love that. The baby blue trim everywhere. Again, with my logo there. You know, we got the two on the side there. Remember about Jeter. Uh, I've never done gray, so I thought this year I'm gonna do that. The little purple outline of the swoosh in there for the details. Yeah, that's what we got for the road. My favorite sneaker of all time would have to be the Jordan 11 Concords. I think that colorway is just looks so timeless. Um, with the black and the white. The 11s are my favorite, but as of right now, the Jordan 1 Mocha are my go-tos. You know, with the, the black here, patent leather, and then the white. This is what I'm on right now, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna be rocking these for a while. So of my collection, I think my top three pairs, the Union 4s I just got during quarantine. I'm really big on the biohack ones that I have. I think those are kind of slept on, but those, you know, the multicolor, you can wear those with anything. And those really pop for me. A pair that, you know, kind of fly under the radar, they're the, the Captain Jeter Air Jordan 1 pair, high tops. The bottom, is, you know, on the sole, it says Captain, and they're obviously navy and white. Um, after the Yankees, so those are those are my three tops for sure. This has been Kicking It, presented by Nike. I'm Trevor Story. We'll see you next time. Line drive. Oh! Trevor Story, oh man, remember that one. That basketball coming back there for Trev. I didn't know if he's going to be able to hang long enough. And even everybody else is jumping with them, too. You and I included. And right, exactly. And his teammates. He thinks he's got a base hit. Look how high Look at the Matt. ground Max, he is. Max got a foot up. I saw Joshua is jumping up. Herman's jumping. Bader is picked off. Crone makes a good throw. And the tag by Story. Very athletic play by Story. <laughs> because he had a ways to go to get to the bag. And we've said this about CJ. Not only does he have a powerful arm, he's been really accurate with it. I like the way Trevor takes this because it's a better throw and an easier throw for the first baseman. But how about this blind tag by Trevor? <laughs> that, that's so much fun to watch. He's got experience doing this. And that's a big fly there from Story, which may get him a bonus. And he hit that beautiful pitch inside right there. That's exactly what Redmond's been doing. Feeding it in. That's where he asked for it. That's what they're that's what they've been practicing all along. That's 518. If, if that's 518, we are about to see some really big time blasts here. To the right of the rubber. This ball crushed deep left field. Stay fair. It is a fair ball. Two run home run. Trevor Story. Boy, that got out in a hurry. Think a way you're able to then pull this ball inside because it's just a reactionary swing then on the Subaru Supermo. 
just hoping it didn't have too much hook on it. That's all you could worry about, and it did. And just hooked around that pole down into the tunnel. Oh, the pat flip is so good. <laughs> CJ Crone, his second home run of the night, and a diving stop. Flip to Rogers. I've never seen that one. Six, four, three. Jason <laughs> Rogers to be prepared for it. Oh, this is beautiful. Hot potato. Be ready for it. Get him out. Not even close. Not even close. And it was a glove flip or a glove shovel. Well, CJ almost had an ice cream cone from it, too. <laughs> exactly. I mean, like, these guys are making crazy plays. CJ, do your part. That is fun. Trevor Story, a double and two tries. Oh, yes. oh. this ball hammered deep center field. Take a good look. You won't see it for long. Trevor Story. I know what you're thinking at home. You hope it's not the last one in purple at Coors Field for Trevor. But that one, if it was, was had a majestic longest. flight. Soak it in. In the purple, and for his story, he's gonna put on the goggles. Today is Trevor's 375th game at Coors Field, which is 13th in club history. This was Trevor taking the field and his teammates pulled back and he was out there for for a good you know 10 seconds before everyone joined him. Just a way for his teammates to honor him and say thank you. And this is going to find its way into right field. Charlie will stop at second. What did you say about you know 50 mile an hour hey, exit velocity. It just seems like it might be that kind of day here. Yeah the fans for about. Good 10 seconds. See if Trevor can get a leg hit here. Key boom. Couldn't get him. But Trevor's two for two. Runners are going. And a ground ball to short. Escobar with it. And he throws it away. It bounces right back to Bell. And a throw to third. Blackman is safe. They, they gave him a hit because LCD's played that into a hit. At Coors Field, and this could be another hit. It will be get under the glove of uh, Alcides Escobar. Now he's trying for second, and he's going to be out there. See uh, uh, the fans that are left, many standing because I know it's going through your mind. This could be the final Coors Field at bat for Trevor in a Rockies uniform. We hope not. We shall see. Well, the day remains perfect. Trevor has reached for the fifth time. Four singles and a walk. And McMahon with Story coming home. And Trevor going on contact will score. 27 always left it on the field. 